delicacy. It's fermented and aged in barrels, almost like wine, and it's great flavoring for fish. I like to marinate firm halibut fillets in balsamic vinegar, honey, and garlic. Under the broiler, the marinade turns into a deep brown glaze, and the fish stays juicy and flavorful. Then I reduce the marinade on the stove top to make a thick sauce. There's one way to describe halibut with balsamic glaze. Delicious! I happen to love halibut. You know why? Because it can be prepared in lots of different ways. And did you know it's the biggest fish in the ocean, flatfish in the ocean? It can even grow to 300 pounds. Some interesting tidbits. And so we have here some, some halibut fillets, not too thick so that I can put them in the broiler and they'll cook quickly. Also, I'm gonna marinate them. Really good marinade. Sweet, syrupy balsamic vinegar. And we're gonna use about half a cup and it doesn't have to be great quality balsamic vinegar. It could just be regular balsamic vinegar because we're going to reduce it in the pan. That's what's so great about this marinade is that you get to marinate the fish and still use the same marinade as the topping and the sauce. So it's so easy. We're going to use two tablespoons of honey. I like the honey in here. A little bit of extra virgin olive oil. We'll mix it all together. A couple tablespoons. You need a little bit of olive oil to sort of balance out the acid from the vinegar. And of course, some garlic. That's a marinade without some garlic in it, right? So, especially an Italian marinade. Gotta have the garlic. And we're gonna let the halibut marinate for a while. It can be minimum of 30 minutes. You've got to at least leave it in there for 30 minutes. Otherwise, the fish doesn't um, absorb the flavors. I'm just going to mince the garlic, and we'll put it directly into the marinade. Just whisk that all together, and oh, that looks good. I'm just going to put these steaks these halibut steaks. Look how nice it's white, it's firm. Oh, it's so good. I'm just going to put the marinade right over it. So put it in like an 8 inch baking pan. And then make sure that the marinade coats all of the fish. You know, that it gets underneath and the sides and everywhere. plastic wrap. All right, let's put this in the fridge. And I've got one here that's already been marinating, and you can see that the marinade is already thickened a little bit. Look. Ready to 
just drizzle the sauce right over the top. Just drizzle a little bit all around. So it's like eating steak, right? Fast, easy. You think this looks good? I've got everybody's seafood favorite.